Hi there, Spark fans, Rob Reynolds here. For my money, motors are always a great addition to a project. They make things spin around. They make our autonomous cars move, our drones fly, and our companion bots look back and forth. And of course, there are a lot of different types of motors too. AC motors, DC motors, servo motors, stepper motors, and naturally, each motor requires its own specific driver. But what happens here at SparkFun if we have a motor and notice we don't have a driver for it? Usually, we quit and give up. Mm -hmm. Apparently, I am mistaken. We do not quit and give up. We find the latest chip, create a board, and we present it to you like this. Introducing the new SparkFun three-phase brushless motor driver. The heart of this new driver breakout is the TMC 6300 IC. The chip has a voltage range of 2 to 11 volts DC with a max current of 2 amps, an operating current of 7 milliamps, and a standby current of under 50 nanoamps. For the I.O. connections, there are three half bridges. On the input side, there are high side and low side MOSFET pairs with low RDS on on both sides of just 170 milliohms. On the output side is the motor drive phase. It's also got current sense, a diagnostic indicator, regulated 1.8 volt power, and a charge pump. Additionally, it offers thermal shutdown protection at 150 degrees C plus short circuit shutdown. The board itself has 0.1 inch spaced pinouts for input power and ground, charge pump, I.O. logic level, and standby control, plus the three MOSFET pairs with output for current sense, diagnostic, and power out from the three bridges. Our board layout is designed with LEDs and labels facing up and the IC facing down, and we did this for a reason. This is to encourage you, the user, to use the board that way with the thermal pad facing up in case you need to do additional cooling. Also, the pins have been specifically aligned to fit perfectly into a breadboard and hold the headers more perpendicular for ease of assembly. And once you do that, well then we can make things spin around, like this. Now, controlling a three-phase motor requires a bit deeper dive than, say, a standard DC hobby motor or even a stepper motor, especially on the hardware side. Uh, this board requires six PWM signals to control a single motor. Uh, we found that the Arduino Simple FOC library works really well with this board, but there are some hardware limitations, uh, specifically which microcontrollers actually are capable of six PWM mode. But if you need complete control of your brushless motor, this is the board for you. Check out the new SparkFun brushless motor driver over at sparkfun.com. And of course, stay safe, be kind, and happy hacking. Our board layout has been, can't say specifically yet, that's a later word, specifically aligned to, our board layout has been designed, headers more perpendicular, we, <laughs> it has, we didn't just, throw things in a pot. Also, the, also, also, I can't even say it when I'm not saying it. Also,